Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do your September uh, 2018 general love reading. So this is just for love. And these will be the love messages for September. Um, thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Let's get started. <clears throat> we have our shells here. We'll save the other announcements till the end. Some of you are like in an upside down relationship. You've been dealing with this for a number of years, for some time here. You finally gotten to a point of being strong enough, having enough courage to kind of turn your back on it. But you're still, in a sense, open to it because you're open to reconciliation or making it work because either no one else has come in for you or the person that you really want is not. Um, I guess it's, you're kind of in discord with them also. So there's just not a functional situation right now. Um, some of you have a heavy heart. You really want to talk to someone. You're not in um, contact with them. Either you cut them off, they cut you off, whatever. Uh, there's just no contact here. Some of you have a heavy heart about children your adult children, young adult children, um, acting out, getting in trouble, legal problems, legal issues, not enough money to go around in regards to that. Uh, Spirit said you baby this child. You baby, you, you baby or you, you have babied this child you've you know I guess smothered if, if that's another word to use um, okay you're the reason for some of this this behavior if you want something to change you have to change that's where just probably a small number of you Some of you, yeah, <clears throat> legal problems. Some of you may have gotten a new job or a promotion. You want to talk to somebody about this. It's like you can't talk to this person. You want to talk to them about the newness in your life. You you want to share it with them. You want to do a lot for this person. Your heart is so open to them, but yet so close because you haven't really spoken exactly how you feel about them. You've left things up in the air. You've left things up for interpretation. And it's just not working. Some of you are just getting along to go along with a partner. But you're, they have somebody else. Um, you have somebody else too, but y'all aren't communicating. This person has somebody else. Um that they're entertaining. Yeah, they may even have two people. Um, uh, lots of abundance here. I don't really see a whole bunch of financial issues. For some of you, it could be wavering, it could be up and down, but for some of you, it's really stable. It's just that you've created so much havoc confusion and frustration in your life in your love life that now you have to kind of make you have to clean up the mess you've made are you getting divorced or are you not that's what I just heard Some of you know you don't want to marry this person. Okay. Uh, it, things are just coming in scattered now. Okay, Cancer. Let's get into the card. All right. All right. Love reading. Uh, past, present, future energy. Okay. Past, present, future energy. One. 
Okay. Some of you, you have health issues. You have issues with your health that um, you don't think a partner will accept. Okay. A new partner or an ex-partner. Um, pray for healing. Uh, look into holistic ways of trying to remedy, remedy I guess, um, whatever is going on with you. Uh, this keeps some of you stuck to a partner because you feel like no one new will accept this, whatever it is. Um, and uh, they know your secret. Bottom of the deck, Ten of Pentacles. Nice, good health, um, strong financial life. Um, you've done some building up. Some of you could have a family. You know, real solid family life. That's it. Past the Queen of Wands, presently the Six of Swords. Future Page of Wands. So it looks like in the future you will um, take some action give a message of you wanting or someone gives you a message of wanting to restart Aquarius this is it I said Aquarius so some of you dealing with Aquarius Aries Sagittarius Leo Sagittarius in particular in the past some of you trying to get to a more placid place in your life a more calm state there has been turbulence or there is turbulence there's been interference, jealousy, backbiting, um, trying to one-up partners, trying to, do, you know, if you have somebody, then I'll get somebody, and it's just been crazy. Queen of Wands. Who's this Queen of Wands in the past? Very intuitive person. Could be a hidden person, too, male or female. Knight of Pentacles. Now, I don't know if this is you. Or this is someone you were dealing with. Someone wanted to offer you something, Cancer. Or vice versa. Um, the, the, the stable offer. You know, of course, I'm invested emotionally. Um, you know, physically. But I want to wrap all of that up into the Pentacle. Into well, let's start a relationship. Well, let's take the next step into doing, you know, whatever it is to solidify this. That's what the Knight of Pentacles is. And this person might have been slow about it. Or you were slow about it, okay? Queen of Pentacles in the reverse here. In the present. Some of you are moving away from someone who's completely about themselves. Might be a little over indulgent monetarily. Can completely uh, maybe a workaholic someone's moving away from you or you moving away from them uh, Gemini Libra Aquarius Capricorn Virgo Taurus someone who could be um, materialistic they're, they're all about the look of things they don't care upright she's you know the homemaker the peacemaker luxury uh, just everything a wife you want in a wife or a husband in the reverse she's all of those things for the wrong reason it's the it's the outer appearance so cancer you could have been dealing with somebody who's just all about the outer appearance of things you know let's make it appear like whatever you know like we're happy like we're maybe the ten of pentacles Judgment in the reverse. These cards are not even reversed. Either. Um, you might be coming to somebody, or that someone's coming to you with a message of, you know, let's start this over, let's reignite this. It looks like there is no second chance. It brings you to some heavy anxiety. This could be that other person. They might be younger than you. They give you some fast and hard truth, but it starts anew for you. 
I think you pick up and you move on. Whatever moving on is for you. What's this Ace of Swords? Knight of Cups. They may give you some truth about them wanting to start something with someone else. The devil. Okay, hold on. You, something, maybe some of you are not giving a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, a second chance. Or, they, or vice versa. You could be any sign for that matter. Somebody's in heavy anxiety about giving truth and clarity to maybe a Cancer and Piscean person, Scorpio. They have so much fear about offering their cup. But I, but there's so much love here. Let's see. There's, there's fear coupled with love, with someone not wanting to make the situation solid because they have options. They have, they're emotionally confused about this relationship. There might be competition. Yeah. This person, whoever this is, cancer going forward. You're going to have to do a lot to get them back or get their attention back. They they have a lot of suitors. They're the nine of pentacles. Could be uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They have to let go of the ego. Some things have to fall for them. Yeah. This is for that, that sector of people who are not in communication. Some of you are not in communication with the one that you really love because of the ego. Right? Secrets and lies. Somebody secretly still trying to work on this? Yeah, there's your cancer. Yeah, you, you're not letting this person go. Right? The high priestess. You, you you secretly know this is the person for you. You want communication with who you deem as the empress. Could be Libra, Taurus, Sun, Moon, Horizon. Anyhow, y'all get a personal reading. This is a hot diggity dog mess. Bottom of the deck, Six of Pentacles. Trying to find that balance. You know where the, the balance lies with a particular person. Uh, oh, oh, 12 minutes here. Yeah, um, You've given a lot. Uh, what's poking out of the deck is the Three of Swords. Some of you are just going to go ahead and either separate, divorce. It might have been due to infidelity. You know, so. I don't know. You're not talking to somebody. You want to talk to them a year from now. Okay? So if you got answers out here, here are your angel answers. Okay? So got questions? Here are your answers recovery wow yeah some of you need to go into that recovery mode that four of swords i'm here some of you are going to recover what was lost in the near future okay. one more number seven There's someone in the mist within the next three weeks. Choose a new direction. Um, there's someone in your mist. Uh, they know what the connection means to to the both of you. But you, either you or the other person has taken you through so much that you're just doing nothing. And you might be coming up as a high priestess. You know, she knows a lot, but she does nothing. Right, she just lets spirit move, and um, that might be you, Cancer. 
or that might be the person you're dealing with. They're just like, I'm not fighting for this. I'm not running after. I'm not calling. I'm not talking. I'm not. Let me tell you all the things I'm not doing, you know? So, like I said, in the near future, you're going to have to do a lot to get this person back because, um, first of all, they have options. And then second of all, you either you've done a lot or they've done a lot to you, vice versa. Body changes, hobbies, changing your mind, relationship dynamics, forgiveness, welcome the new, healing from the past. All right, so that's a lot here. There is newness for some of you. Um, it looks like even after a rejection, you, you'll get to a place of, you know, trying to create newness or allow newness to come in for you forgiveness some of you need to forgive someone or you need to ask for forgiveness like i said some of you some of you not all of you have done things uh, to the point where a person just really is doing nothing you've got a forgiveness is of course it's words is it's actually saying the words but also maybe action too. You gotta take some action here. Relationship dynamics. Someone has entered, exited the relationship. The dynamics have changed. Your your feelings around a certain relationship have changed. So now your mind is changing. That's okay. You do, we do that from time to time, especially when we get more information. When we process feelings, hobbies. Some of you um, are the high priestess. You get a lot of downloads. You you know things uh, internally. Um, spiritually uh, some of you can be turning a hobby and monetizing a hobby that'll be an extra income for you um, or if not you need to get a hobby because you're exerting a lot of energy into the wrong or person or thing body changes some of you need to um, listen to the changes of your body when your body starts talking listen some of you are bodybuilding some of you are working out there's body changes so that's a plus there healing from the past you have to someone took you through the ringer or vice versa but healing and forgiveness all right so cancer if this resonated for you please like share comment subscribe body changes too maybe about that that illness or whatever you're living with body changes and in recovery healing will come to you know that Request a personal reading. Uh, all of my information is below. I'm going to re revamp my website because it's just not functional. And I know some people get in the comments and be like, yes, it's not. No. I know, I know. <laughs> it's just not functional. So if you find that it's not working for you, just send me an email and we can set things up manually, okay? Um, thank you, Cancer, for tuning in. Take advantage of the $20 to question reading. Um, I think that's over at the website or, or send me an email in regards to that please mention that you know uh, anyway know that I'm praying for you cancer pray for me as well take care guys happy Labor Day if you're in the States All right.